You guys have no idea what you're getting yourselves into, do you? <laughs> it's a boat. It really is. <laughs> Spell it, Adriel. Spell it. B O T A. Boat. I don't know how to spell. <laughs> we are clear, guys. Now, everybody raise your hands and wave goodbye to those skippers on the dock. We are never gonna see them again. But that's okay because you have never seen them before, so that really doesn't matter, does it? Now, wave goodbye to my biggest fans all the way up there. Yeah, we just got those for Christmas this year. They are my favorite. My name is Skipper Adriel. I'm gonna be your ho-ho host for the next 12 days and one silent night. But before we get started, just as a quick reminder, please stay seated for me with your hands, your arms, your legs and your feet inside the boat. Parents, please watch your children. Children, please watch your parents. I don't trust them either, okay? <laughs> Is anybody riding the Jingle Cruise for the first time ever? Jingle. Me too, guys. I am so excited. You have no idea. But I actually believe in nautical law. Nautical law says that the captain of the ship should always go down with that ship. What's your name, by the way? Everybody say hi to Captain Isabella for me. Thank you so much. But let's get started out here in the Amazon River where it rains 365 days a year. You guys hear that waterfalling sound? Yeah, we like to call that a waterfall. And we like to call that waterfall Inspiration Falls. Now the reason why we call it Inspiration Falls is the more you look at it, guys, the more they will inspire you to go. That's right, deeper and deeper into the jungle. Now everybody say, ooh. ooh. Everybody say, ah. Uh. Ah. Wow, I don't know about you guys, but that sounded like a whole lot of inspiration. It was so beautiful. But guys, it looks like we're entering the Congo River. Now let's see how far we can go. They're not gonna get much better, guys. I don't know what you're waiting for. Yeah, but it sounds like the Pygmy Villagers are having a little bit of a holiday party for you guys to welcome you here to the jungle. They're all super funny, just like me. So everybody wave hello. Nobody showed up. That actually reminds me a lot of my 16th birthday. Nobody showed up to that either. I know, it's so sad. It? <laughs> it looks like somebody's getting an old tree for Christmas this year. They even wrapped it up with a ball on top. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> Yeah, but my camp is just right around the corner. I did some decorating, some cleaning and organizing for you guys. So it looks nice and neat when you got here. It's just... Oh, no! It looks like my in-laws made it in for the holidays. That's okay. I can't be too mad at them. They got my Jeep to turn over. I could not get it started this morning. Yeah, maybe they call Triple Ape or something. I don't know. But guys, we are entering the Nile River. The Nile River is the longest river in the world. It goes on for Niles and Niles and Niles and Niles. And if you don't believe me, folks, you're definitely in denial. Yeah, the river's really hard to navigate this time of year. It has a really strong yule tide. That's an African bull elephant, yeah. I taught these guys how to communicate myself. They're actually very great. You know, they tell me how they feel all the time. What? Why? What do you want from me? All right, I'll tell them, jeez! She wants me to tell you there's a Jungle Cruise movie coming out next year called The Jungle Cruise. This is the star of the movie, The Rock. Isn't it cool? Yeah. <laughs> This is the African belt. I'm gonna show you some cool animals here in the African belt. We have the gray cows that killed Mufasa right there. We have a 1971 Impala on top of the hill. And that right there, kids, we have a sleeping zebra. You know, that's how zebras sleep in the wild, surrounded by lions. Yeah, she actually looks dead tired, so we're just gonna move on and let her rest in peace, okay? Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful Oh, no. You guys see the guy at the bottom of that pole? His name is Ahantis. It looks like that rhino's trying to poke Ahantis. <laughs> but just around the river bend! Because <laughs> I am killing it right now, honestly. <laughs> I do want to show you some cool plants we have here in the jungle. All the way up there, we have some hibiscus. Right there in the bottom, we have some lobiscus. Yeah, and in the water, we have some sea biscuits. I'll be here all day, unfortunately. Yeah, sure. But that right there, that's the beautiful Schweitzer Falls. Now, Schweitzer Falls was named after the world's famous North Pole explorer, Dr. Snow Falls. Well, that joke had a little bit of a frosty response, didn't it? Everybody breathe that in. Woo! Woo! Yeah, doesn't that feel so good? So refreshing. Moisturize a little, guys. Soak it into your pores. Yeah, it feels really good, doesn't it? 
Yeah, that's actually packed full of jungle bacteria. <laughs> Everybody on this boat, you're gonna feel it in about 48 hours, don't you worry. <laughs> By the way, it looks like all the planes have been grounded again. Don't you just hate holiday travel? <laughs> Yeah, there was a really good sell on planes this year for Black Friday. They will all half off, believe it or not. Uh-oh. Guys, we're being surrounded by some hungry, hungry hippos. I guess I should have been way more specific on my Christmas list. But don't worry, I'm a trained professional. I know how to scare them off. Hey! Keep the change, you filthy animals! No, don't worry, guys. We're never going to hear from them again. But we're not completely woods just yet just look around here there's trees everywhere it looks like we're heading into headhunter territory trust me folks that's a horrible place to be headed yeah if you don't believe me ask my last crew they were all on the naughty list what a bunch of boneheads honestly but over here we have some natives yeah they're having a christmas party it's so much fun this year they can't even move yeah they even got the little drummer boy to perform for them i love these guys they invite me every year to the parties we have a blast oh no back at them we can't keep souvenirs nothing's free except my smile <laughs> but folks the moment you've all been waiting for the eighth wonder of the world up backside of water oh two h oh two h oh two h thank you so much for the rest of you guys i think we actually might be family because you're not being very supportive right now <laughs> It's okay, I'll get over it. But this is the Mekong River deep in the heart of Cambodia. I've actually never seen that place before. I don't know what's in there. There could be danger. There could be treasure. But this is Walt Disney World, so it might just be another gift shop. <laughs> actually, keep your eyes open. It looks like it's going to be Santa's workshop. Let's see what we can find. Oh, no, it's actually a root canal. <laughs> I hate those! just in time and right into the pool of the sacred indian elephant if you guys look right over there underneath the waterfall we like to call that elephant bertha every year we love to shower bertha with presents but this year we decided to give her their shower present of showering yeah she was really oh hey no 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 guys stop 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 sometimes these guys just like to spray the boat hey be nice santa's watching yeah this is not funny if you come back up, we're gonna have a problem. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm so sorry, guys. Yeah. So this is what we like to call a little bit of dry humor. And I know what you guys are thinking. It's just water coming out of their trunks. It's not. Oh. Oh no, guys. Over here, though, to my left-hand side, we have my best friend in the world, Trader Sam. Everybody say, ho, 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 Sam. Oh, ho, 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 Sam. Trader Sam is the head salesman here in the jungle, but sales have been shrinking for quite some time. So he's having a great deal for you guys today. He wants to give you two of his heads for just one of yours. Any way you cut it, slice it, or dice it, folks, you're coming out ahead. But it looks like we're making it to the most dangerous part of our journey. Today they return to civilization. So please stay seated for me with your hands, your arms, your legs, and your feet inside the boat. If not, you might experience peer pressure on the dock, okay? Uh -huh. 
So this is the part of the trip where I run out of script and I have to entertain you guys without one for now. <laughs> it's my favorite part. Yeah, this is what I get for going to school for four years to get an arts degree. <laughs> that is not a joke. <laughs> you know, there's a lot of people out there, they say... Yeah, I know, I hate my jokes too. <laughs> they say, wow, Skipper Adriel, your job is very pointless because all you do is go around in circles all day. But honestly, guys, I love it out here. You know, it's so much fun. My parents are actually very proud of my two younger brothers. <laughs> yeah, they're doctors. <laughs> You know, I wanted to be a doctor, I just didn't have the patience. I gave it a shot, that's all that matters. You guys are gonna ride every single one of my boats from now on. <laughs> By the way guys, I know you're looking over here like, wow, you guys have two docks, that's pretty confusing. Well, that's why we like to call that a paradox. You see the two skippers on the dock, we like to call them a pair of dorks. <laughs> Don't tell them, one of them's my boss, I really need this job. I have 47 cats. I need it. Oh, that's a lot of pressure. By the way, do you guys remember Trader Sam over there? He's my best friend, honestly. He really is. He invited me and my girlfriend over for Thanksgiving dinner the other day. It was so much fun, guys. We ate. We uh, played some uh, games. We sang some karaoke. At the end of the night, I came up to Sam and I said, Sam, your wife makes a great stew. He oh. said, yeah, she really does, but I'm really going to miss her. Oh. <laughs> I'm just messing with you guys. I don't have a girlfriend. <laughs> I work at the Jungle Cruise. <laughs> if this was Splash Mountain, maybe. People love that place. It's so cold out there. I don't know why. Where are you guys from, by the way? Illinois? Me too. Nice. Yeah. yeah, nice. Yeah, me too. What about you guys? Where are you from? Missouri. Missouri? Me too. Nice. Very cool. Very cool. How about back there? All the way back there. Where are you guys from? I'm sorry? I heard you. I'm just sorry. <laughs> I'm just mad from Georgia, so we go dogs. Yeah. I love Nashville. I can live in Nashville, honestly. And Gallenberg? You know what I'm talking about. Ooh. I love the mountains. As you can tell, guys, I'm desperately running out of jokes right now. <laughs> you know, it's actually awkward moments like this where I'm running out of jokes. It reminds me a lot about dating. It's very uncomfortable. Nobody's talking, and all I want to do is just get out of here, honestly. But I've had so much fun with you guys today that I'm actually going to go around again. <laughs> and again. And again. <laughs> oh, no. Is anybody going to catch the fireworks tonight? No, don't catch them, they're hot. <laughs> the good news is, folks, I heard they're banging. For you younger kids on the boat, I heard they're pretty lit. <laughs> I'm not even his dad and I embarrassed him. <laughs> 25 years old and I'm just like... <laughs> you know a guy called me Gabriel Iglesias on my last boat? <laughs> yeah, I think he called me fat. Oh. Or fluffy, yeah. It still hurts. <laughs> oh! It's okay, guys. I do want to say this before we get off the boat. Out of all the crews that I've had so far today, you have definitely been the most recent. I mean, <laughs> from the bottom of my heart. I know. I, I do the same thing every morning. I cry a little. Yeah, sounds right. That's right. <laughs> Hey, how are you guys? <laughs> At least I'm not by myself. I love having co-workers on my boats. How are you? Good, how are you? Great. Okay. We're just talking, guys. I don't know what else you want from me, okay? <laughs> I do want to thank some of our sponsors. The first one being Animal Crackers. They taught us all animals do taste the same. Also, Zebra Jerky, the every other white meat. A miracle boat because honestly with me driving it's a miracle we made it all the way around I've been saving this joke for the whole day just for a moment like this this is the funniest joke I can think of my career oh. <laughs> it's the only thing that doesn't float around here it just sinks oh. okay I'm just kidding guys I love it here <laughs> is anybody celebrating a birthday today well, there's me. There goes that one. Show your pants. You are. 
you don't have your pin with you. That's okay. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> Did you?